Welcome to Quiz Time. I'm your quiz master, Sean, and I've got 100 questions about world knowledge for you. So pack your brains, relax, and let's have some fun. Beginning with question number one. What term describes the image, imaginary line between democracy and communism in Europe? Is it the Iron Curtain? Is it the Red Scare? Or is it McCarthyism? And that would be the Iron Curtain. What event marked the official end of the Cold War in 1991? The fall of the Berlin Wall? The dissolution of the Soviet Union? Or the Cuban Missile Crisis? The dissolution of the Soviet Union. Which term is coined for the economic and rapid reconstruction of a country after a war? Wirtschaftswunder, Wirtschaftswundein, or Wirtschaftswunder? That would be Wirtschaftswunder. Which country experienced a post-war Wirtschaftswunder? France, Italy, or West Germany? And that would be West Germany. What was the name of the Soviet space program that launched the first artificial satellite, Sputnik 1, in 1957? Was it the Luna program? Was it the Vostok program? Or was it the R-7? It was the R-7 program. What was the name of the first American woman in space? Was that Sally Ride? Was that Valentina Tereshkova? Or was it Krista McAuliffe? American woman in space. And that was Sally Ride. What was the name of the Soviet space station that orbited the Earth from 1986 to 2001? Was it Salyut 1? Was it Mir? Or was it Skylab? And that's Soviet space station was Mir. Who was the first American to orbit the Earth and later became the oldest person to fly in space? Was it Alan Shepard? Was it John Glenn? Or was it Gus Grissom? And it was John Glenn. Which British monarch led the expansion of the British Empire during the 19th century? Was it Queen Elizabeth II? Was it King George III? Or was it Queen Victoria? It was Queen Victoria. The said expansion only happened after the defeat of France in this war. The Napoleonic Wars, World War II, or the Victorian War. That would be the Napoleonic Wars. In the 19th century, the British Empire expanded their trade mainly in these Southeast Asian countries except one. Was it Japan? Was it China? Or was it Korea? All except Korea. In what year did India gain independence from British rule? 1947, 1950, or 1962? and they gained their independence in 1947. What was the impact of the Opium Wars on British colonial history? Was it the acquisition of Hong Kong, the Southeast Asia expansion, or trade with Japan? And that would be the acquisition of Hong Kong. Which British explorer is credited with the circumnavigation of the globe during the 16th century? Was that Sir Francis Drake? Was it James Cook? Or was it Sir Walter Raleigh? And that was Sir Francis Drake. Which Portuguese explorer was credited as a leader in the first circumnavigation of the globe? Was that Ferdinand Madelo? 
Was it Ferdinand Magellan or was it Fernando Cabalan? It was Ferdinand Magellan. Who was a key figure in India's nonviolent resistance against British colonial rule? Jawaharlal Nehru, Mahatma Gandhi, or Subhas Chandra Bose? And that was Subhas Chandra Bose. What movement advocated alcohol restriction in the 1920s? Was it the suffragette movement? Was it the temperance movement? Or was it the prohibition movement? That was the prohibition movement. Which legislation passed in 1920 granted women the right to vote in the United States? Was that the 19th Amendment? Was it the Equal Rights Amendment? Or was it the Suffrage Act? It was the 19th Amendment. Who was the famous aviator and the first woman to fly solo across the Atlantic Ocean in 1928? Was that Amelia Earhart? Was it Bessie Coleman? Or was it Catherine Stinson? That was Amelia Earhart. What cultural and artistic movement in Paris influenced literature, visual arts, and fashion during the 1920s? Was that surrealism? Was it Art Deco or was it Dadaism? It was Art Deco. Which famous organized crime figure became a symbol of the Prohibition era gangster during the 1920s? John Dillinger, Al Capone, or Bonnie and Clyde? And that crime figure was Al Capone. Which criminal figure was notorious during the Great Depression in the United States? Was it John Dillinger? Was it Al Capone? Or was it Bonnie and Clyde? And that was Bonnie and Clyde. What date did Bonnie and Clyde's criminal spree come to an end? May 23, 1934, September 23, 1936, or February 28, 1930. And it came to an end in May 23, 1934. True or false? The couple was ambushed by law enforcement near Sales Bienville Parish, Louisiana. Hmm. They were caught? Yep, that's true. Near Sales in Louisiana. Which 1925 novel delves into the disillusionment of the American dream in the Roaring Twenties? Was it The Great Gatsby, or The Sun Also Rises, or maybe The Sound and the Fury? And that would be The Great Gatsby. Who authored The Great Gatsby? Was that Ernest Hemingway? Was it written by William Faulkner? Or was the author, author F. Scott Fitzgerald? And the author of The Great Gatsby was F. Scott Fitzgerald. What ornate architectural style gained popularity in the Victorian era? Was it the Gothic Revival, Art Nouveau, or was that Neoclassical? And that would be Gothic Revival. What event in 1859, written by Charles Darwin, proposed the theory of evolution by natural selection, the origin of species, the descent of man, on the origin of evolution? It was the origin of species. Which iconic detective debuted in Sir Arthur Conan Doyle's Victorian novel, A Study in Scarlet? Was it Hercule Poirot? Was it Sherlock Holmes? Or was it Miss Marple? And that was Sherlock Holmes. What was London's Crystal Palace built for the 1951 Great Exhibition? Was it the Crystal Palace, the Great Pavilion, or Exhibition Hall? It was built for the Crystal Palace. 
who was the influential Victorian era author known for works like Jane Eyre and Wuthering Heights? Was that Charles Dickens, Charlotte Bronte, or Emily Bronte? And that author was Charlotte Bronte. One major conflict, fought from 1853 to 1856, involved Russia, the Ottoman Empire, France, and Britain, the Napoleonic Wars, the Crimean War, or the Franco-Prussian War. And that was the Crimean War. When did the Victorian era officially end with the death of Queen Victoria? January 24, 1899, January 22, 1901, or January 12, 1910. Queen Victoria died on January 22, 1901. Who was the Italian Renaissance artist known for works such as David and The Ceiling of the Sistine Chapel? Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, or Raphael? And that's Michelangelo. Which German monk and theologian sparked the Protestant Reformation in 1517 with 95 theses? Martin Luther, John Calvin, or was it Henry VIII? And that was Martin Luther. Which powerful banking family from Florence were patrons of the arts during the Renaissance? The Borgia family, the Medici family, or was it the Sforza family? And that was the Medici family. What is Dante Alighieri's renowned 14th century literary masterpiece in world literature? Is it the Divine Comedy, the Canterbury Tales, or the Prince? And that would be the Divine Comedy. Who was the English playwright and poet, often referred to as the Bard? Is it Christopher Marlowe? Is it William Shakespeare? Or is it Ben Jonson? Who is the Bard? The Bard is William Shakespeare. Which Turkish city fell to the Ottoman Turks in 1453? signaling the end of the Middle Ages and the start of the Renaissance. That Turkish city was Constantinople. When did the fall of Constantinople happen? May 29th, 1453, May 26th, 1452, or May 19th, 1449? Constantinople fell in on May 29th, 1453. What Renaissance technique creates a 3D illusion on a flat surface? Is it chiaroscuro, sfumato, or is it called perspective? And that's called perspective. Who was the Queen of England during the Elizabethan era, known for her support of the arts and exploration? The Queen of England during the Elizabethan era. Well, that would be Queen Elizabeth I. What invention played a crucial role in powering the Industrial Revolution by improving the efficiency of steam engines? Playing a crucial role in the Industrial Revolution? The steam engine. Who patented the steam engine in 1769? Was the patent owner James Watt? Was it Alan Turing? Or was it Thomas Edison who patented the steam engine? That would be James Watt. What pioneered the Industrial Revolution with inventions like the spinning jenny and water frame, the steel industry, the textile industry, or the coal mining industry? That would be the textile industry. What device was invented in 1831 that significantly increased the efficiency of harvesting crops? The mechanical spiel, the mechanical harvester, or the mechanical reaper? 
and that would be the Mechanical Reaper. Who is credited with inventing the Mechanical Reaper? Was that Cyrus McCormick? Was it John Deere? Or was it Eli Whitney? And that was invented by Cyrus McCormick. What alliance included Germany, Austria-Hungary, and the Ottoman Empire in World War I? Were they the Allied powers? Were they the Central powers? Or were they the Axis powers? They were the Central powers. Who was the leader of Germany during World War I? Was it Otto von Bismarck? Was it Kaiser Franz Joseph? Or was it Kaiser Wilhelm II? And the leader of Germany during World War I was Kaiser Wilhelm II. Question number 50. Which key weapon, heavily utilized in World War I, drastically changed warfare? Were they tanks? Were they machine guns? Or was it poison gas? That key weapon was machine guns. Which treaty, signed in 1919, formally ended World War I and imposed harsh penalties on Germany? Was it the Treaty of Versailles? Was it the Treaty of Brest-Litovsk? Or was it the Treaty of Trianon? It was the Treaty of Versailles. What's the term for the area between World War I trenches? Is that called the trench zone? Is it called the battlefront? Or is it no man's land? That area is called no man's land. Which country exited the war in 1917 due to the Bolshevik Revolution and the advent of communism? Was that France? Was that Russia? Or was that Italy? The Bolshevik Revolution was Russia. Which Italian explorer, sailing under the Spanish flag, is credited with the discovery of the Americas in 1492? Vasco da Gama, Christopher Columbus, or John Cabot? And that would be Christopher Columbus. Which Spanish conquistador conquered the Inca Empire in the early 16th century? Hernán Cortés, Juan Ponce de León, or Francisco Pizarro? That Spanish conquistador, Francisco Pizarro. What was the name of the sea route to Asia, establishing direct trade between Portugal and the East? The Cape of Good Hope, the Strait of Magellan, or the Northwest Passage. And that would be the Cape of Good Hope. Who discovered the sea route called the Cape of Good Hope? Vasco da Gama, Versailles Gao, or Vajas da Gata? And that discoverer was Vasco da Gama. What was the name of the ship that carried the pilgrims to North America in 1620? Did they sail on the Mayflower? Was it the Nina or was it the Santa Maria? The pilgrims, pilgrims came on the Mayflower. Which European power dominated the space trade in the Indian Ocean during the age of exploration? The spice trade in the Indian Ocean during the age of exploration. Spain, England, or Portugal? The spice trade. <laughs> that would be Portugal. What river was crucial to the development of ancient Egyptian civilization? Was that the Nile River, the Tigris River, or the Euphrates River? And that river was the Nile River. True or false? The Euphrates River contributed to fertile soil for agriculture and transportation. Is that true or is it false? That would be false. In ancient Greece, what city-state was known for its military prowess? 
Was it Athens? Was it Sparta? Or was it Corinth? In ancient Greece, it was Sparta. Which civilization in Mexico built pyramids and excelled in astronomy and mathematics? Were they the Incas, the Aztecs, or was it the Mayan civilization? It was the Mayan civilization. What ancient wonder of the world, built in the 3rd century BCE, was a colossal statue? The Gardens of Babylon, the Colossus of Rhodes, or the statue of Zeus at Olympia? It was the Colossus of Rhodes. What is Lao Tzu's philosophy emphasizing harmony with nature and humility? Confucianism, legalism, or Taoism? Lao Tzu's philosophy, Taoism. Who was a powerful queen of ancient Egypt, known for her intelligence and political acumen? Was it Cleopatra VII, Nefertiti, or Hatshepsut? And that was Cleopatra VII. What period did Cleopatra VII rule? The Roman Empire, the Ptolemaic period, or the Pharaonic period? Cleopatra VII ruled the Ptolemaic period. Which ancient Persian religion highlights the struggle between good and evil? Would that be Hinduism, Buddhism, or Zoroastrianism? And that Persian religion is Zoroastrianism. Which prophet founded the Zoroastrianism? The founder of Zoroastrianism. That prophet would be Zoroaster. Which country's hyperinflation and economic crisis in the Great Depression led to Adolf Hitler's rise? That would be Germany. What were the makeshift settlements during the Great Depression in the United States called? Were they called suburbs? Were they called Hoovervilles? Or were they called homesteads? Those makeshift settlements were called Hoovervilles. Which 1935 New Deal legislation introduced unemployment benefits and pensions in the United States? Was that the Emergency Banking Act, the Social Security Act, or the Glass-Steadgall Act? That was the Social Security Act. Which country experienced the Long March, a military retreat by the Red Army? Was that China? Was it Japan? Or was it the Soviet Union? The Long March was experienced by China. Who is the legendary Frankish king who became the first Holy Roman Emperor? Was that William the Conqueror? Was it Alfred the Great? Or was it Charlemagne? That was Charlemagne. Which pope crowned Charlemagne in 800 CE? Hmm. That was Pope Leo III. What event in 1066 marked the Norman conquest of England, ending the Anglo-Saxon era? Was it the Battle of Hastings, the Battle of Stamford Bridge, or the Battle of Agincourt? And that was the Battle of Hastings. What was the main economic system in medieval Europe based on land exchange for service and loyalty? Was it capitalism? Was it mercantilism? Or was it feudalism? That was feudalism. 
which medieval military campaigns aimed to recapture the Holy Land from Muslim control? Was it Reconquista, the Crusades, or the Inquisition? And those were the Crusades. Which 14th century pandemic caused widespread death and economic upheaval in Europe? Was it the Spanish flu? Was it the cholera outbreak? Or was it the Black Death? It was the Black Death. It is a collection of stories that provides insight into the social and cultural life of the medieval times. The Canterbury Tales, the Cabeza Tales, or the Catalina Tales. And that would be the Canterbury Tales. Which medieval English author wrote the Canterbury Tales? Was that Sir Thomas More? Was it Geoffrey Chaucer? Or was it John Wycliffe? The Canterbury Tales were written by Geoffrey Chaucer. What was the name of the conflict between England and France during the late medieval period? Was it the War of the Roses, the Hundred Years' War, or the Spanish Succession? And that would be the Hundred Years' War. The Hundred Years' War happened in what specific years? 1337 to 1453, 1332 to 1448, or 1328 to 1444? And the specific years were 1337 to 1453. It was a notable battle during the Hundred Years' Wars between England and France. Name that battle. And that notable battle was the Battle of Agincourt. Which 17th to 18th century European movement stressed reason, science, and individual rights? Was that the Renaissance? Was that Romanticism? Or was that the Enlightenment? And that was the Enlightenment. Who is often regarded as the father of modern political philosophy and wrote Leviathan? Was that John Locke? Was it Thomas Hobbes? Or Jean-Jacques Rousseau? Leviathan was written by Thomas Hobbes. What is the name of the book that is a key work on social contract theory during the Enlightenment? And that was Leviathan. Which French philosopher and writer advocated for the separation of powers in government? Was that Voltaire? Was that Diderot? Or was it Montesquieu? The French philosopher and writer, Montesquieu. Which Scottish philosopher authored The Wealth of Nations, promoting free market capitalism? Was that Adam Smith? Was it Karl Marx? Or was it John Stuart Mill? That philosopher was Adam Smith. Which 1781 philosophical work by Immanuel Kant delved into human knowledge and reason? Was it the critique of pure reason, the social contract, or the spirit of the laws? It was the critique of pure reason. Which American Enlightenment figure experimented with electricity and helped draft the U.S. Constitution? Was it Thomas Jefferson? Was it Benjamin Franklin? Or was it John Adams? And that was Benjamin Franklin. Who was the founder of the Qin Dynasty and the first emperor to unify China in 221 BCE? Was it Qin Shi Huang? Was it Wu Tao Huang or Qin Fao Han? It was Qin Shi Huang. What ancient Chinese invention from the 2nd century BCE played a crucial role in navigation? Gunpowder, the printing press, 
or was it the compass? It was the compass. Which Chinese philosopher and military strategist wrote The Art of War? Was it Lao Tzu, Confucius, or Sun Tzu? And that would be Sun Tzu. Who was the legendary sage and teacher whose sayings and teachings form the basis of Confucianism? That legendary sage? Confucius. Which pharaoh built the Great Pyramid of Giza, one of the seven wonders of the ancient world? Was that Ramses II? Was it Khufu? Or was it Tutankhamun? And that pharaoh was Khufu. What pictorial script was used in ancient Egypt for religious texts and monumental inscriptions? Was, were they hieroglyphs, cuneiform, or Sanskrit? And those were hieroglyphs. Which jackal-headed deity in ancient Egypt was linked to the afterlife and mummification? Was it Ra? Was it Osiris? Or was it Anubis? The jackal-headed deity was Anubis. Which protective and revered gem was highly prized in ancient Egyptian jewelry? Was it the emerald? Was it the sapphire? Or was it the lapis lazuli? And that was the lapis lazuli. And question 100. Who built the step pyramid at Saqqara, an early monumental structure in ancient Egypt? Was it Imhotep? Was it Amenhotep? Or was it Pothotep? And that was... M. Hotep. That was question 100. Thanks for playing. Drop your score in the comments, please. And don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell and give us a like. This has been Quiz Time. We'll see you in the next video.